I promise you this is going to be the shortest review for a freaking reality show that you'll ever get on my channel. If you Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. You've reached another Teen Mom family reunion and the Lord has shined down his light upon me because this is the last episode of this whack ass show and I am really sorry to tell you, I don't care if five people fight on the next season of Teen Mom Family Reunion. I will never review and recap this show again. I'm, anyway, enough talking. Let me see where we're at. And with this episode is We Are Family. I got all my sisters with me. And it's episode number eight, so let's just get into it. I have my notes, it shouldn't take long. And I'm where we ended last week is where we're starting this week with Macy on the line talking to Gary. Gary says he doesn't know, but then somehow he says, you know what? I don't know because of school and stuff. Lee is not really comfortable, but somehow now he's considering it. So now Zach and Cheyenne have their own little segment and Cheyenne is saying to Zach that she thinks it would be a good idea for him to talk to Coach B. And here I was thinking family reunion was just going to be about the moms. Kate is now negative for COVID. Why is Jay dressed like mother freaking Stevie Nicks from Fleetwood Mac? So oh, Sean and Jade are on a date at an alpaca farm. The alpacas spit at them and I'm not mad at it. It's content. Sean is grateful. So Gary made a way to bring Leah to visit Amber and Gary actually asks Leah if she's excited and she says she doesn't know. So they surprised Amber by sitting there. She was very thankful. The entire scene was so awkward. I feel for Leah because she's really not comfortable around Amber. So now we're here with Coach B, Zach and Cheyenne. And I'm going to be real with y'all. They didn't get into anything special. He refused to talk about his DUI habits. He refused to talk about his legal issues. All Coach B talked to him about was the fact that his mom wasn't barely around for him and they have a strained relationship and how Cheyenne needs to let him be a man and fall back on some things when, it, when in regard to Zach. And that's really all they talked about. More Leah, Gary, and Amber time. So Amber says that she called Leah prior to them visiting to explain why she's been absent this year with court and James and all that stuff and how she had to focus on that. Amber, Leah is sick and tired of your excuses. I can see it in her face. She's tired of your excuses. Do better. So everybody is packing up to go home and now they're making scrapbooks. So Kate says she has a surprise somewhere in the mountains. A surprise was painted canvases with poems from their moms. Now we have a barrage of flashback scenes for stuff we already saw. So all of a sudden they're reminiscing over what's supposed to be good things. And Jade starts talking about April and how April, she didn't like the way April yanked that rope. And girl, you have five episodes to talk about that. You're going to wait until y'all are getting ready to leave and y'all are supposed to end this on a good note to bring up the situation with April in the mud. Really? Anyway, Kate is over there looking like she's upset. Kate is like... I'm going with the flow, riding the river, but Jade needs to calm the F down. I don't, I really don't understand guys how we even got here. I, the entire time I was watching this scene was just praying that they would hurry up and just change the subject, please. So thankfully, Diane decides to change the subject and says, you know, let's talk about what negative thing happened that you can make positive. Then they talk about the fight scene or whatever and Cheyenne's like, you know, I, if we get a situation again when we have another uh, season of this and we notice that people aren't getting along, maybe we need to like sit them down and mediate. And you know what? Frankly, guys, I'm over this conversation. I'm over it. Y'all always do this crap at the end of the damn show. Y'all want to throw on heavy stuff. Y'all want to throw on deep stuff. Y'all literally have 45 minutes to be deep and I'm over it. So now everybody's doing a cheers, glasses clinking, and now they're going to get on a sailboat. I promise you this is going to be the shortest review for a freaking reality show that you'll ever get on my channel. If you like shorter reviews, please holler at your girl. Let me know. And maybe that's the reason why I'm not getting views on these reality show recaps because I'll be doing a whole hour, child. 
And uh, frankly, lately, I ain't got time for that. I have hobbies. I have things to do. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching my channel. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching my channel. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.